As we've seen our biggest and most interesting deals, very often being in, in the emerging markets, we've stepped back and we've looked again at how you should be thinking about these deals. And we're looking at three fundamental risks. We're looking at state risk, we're looking at transactional risk, and we're looking at operational risk. And we're trying to think about each investment against those three lenses, and it helps you come to different conclusions about how you should address the risks. I think the key thing the clients need to know is that you can do something about these risks. And what you're really trying to do is build in resilience to these risks up front. When you're looking to protect your position, investment treaty protection is a really important part of the armory. And what the investment treaty gives you is an overlay of international law over the domestic law. And it gives you access to an international tribunal, not just the domestic tribunals. And we've had some significant success for clients around the world. Investment treaty structuring is at least as important, if not more important, than tax structuring. And clients are beginning to understand the importance of that when they're thinking about major investments in markets around the world.